I love to draw. Now, I'm absolutely horrible at it, but I still like to do it. Now, if you're someone who is actually a pretty good artist, one thing you might want to check out for the iPad is something called Sketchbook Pro. So, I'll open it up and I'll give you a quick example of what some things you can do with it. By all means, I'm not an artist, so don't pay attention to my drawings too much. So, if I tap three fingers on the screen, it'll give me the nice canvas which I have here, and it comes up with the, uh, the dialog box. I can press up the top here in the menu, and I can choose a whole bunch of different patterns. There's, there's about 75 different brushes from, uh, to choose from. So I can choose a different pen. So I've chosen a pencil here, different colors, different uh, cho choices. So I'll just choose red or, or black even, nice and simple. And just, just drawing on the screen. You can use your finger, but you can also purchase uh, styluses online. You can't use a regular stylus. You have to purchase something from a company named Pogo, or there's lots of other different kind of styluses out there if you prefer to draw like that. So you can just draw on the screen. It's nice and easy if I want to undo what I've done. Three finger swipe to the side. Uses great multi-touch for the iPad as well. Three finger swipe down will bring up the, uh, the whole uh, menu item here, all the different brushes to choose from. Uh, I can choose some real funky, like weird patterns and so on. Um, I'm sure there'd be something amazing you could, could draw with it if I could actually draw. So um, yeah, just three, three, once again, three finger across will swipe to undo it. Or uh, you can even zoom in with just the pinch and pinches just as normal. Um, lots of different uh, layers as well. Uh, you can choose up to upwards of six layers if you want to actually create add to on top of it without destroying the image you have underneath it. You can even add in one of your own photographs and touch up one of your photographs if you want to play around with it in that regard too. Uh, touching three screens again brings it back into full screen. There's a little uh, icon button down here and I can change the opacity or the size so uh, how big the, the, uh, the brush that I'm using will look like. Um, Lots, lots of amazing things you can do with it. If you're a great artist and you actually have a, an, any idea of what you're doing, uh, I'd love to see some of the possibilities what you can do. So, uh, myself, not quite there yet, but lots of different eyes and some real kooky stuff with it too. So, it's Sketchbook Pro. It's seven ninety nine. It's on the App Store right now. It's for the iPad. I think there's actual version for the iPhone available too. So, give it a look. Gotta get connected, connected.